Hey everybody, welcome back to Planet Zoo. So, last episode we spent the entire time working on this exhibit and now we are going to change it because I found, uh, I found some stuff. Some stuff that the tigers... Yes, they are tigers. I was like, wait, they're not tigers. No, they're tigers. They're Bengal tigers. Stuff that they might like, which would be the climbing post stuff. So, species, Bengal tiger. Look at this. They got all this stuff that they want to run on. Climbing frame. Look at this. It's a freaking jungle gym. So, I was thinking about putting this one in, and I was going to put it somewhere over in this corner, but I'm going to need to edit this slightly. It would be really nice if it was facing the other way. I forget what I said my exact plan was going to be. I know it involved making the exhibit bigger, but how was I going to orient this? Large. That's not that bad. We could probably put this in somewhere else as well. It would be cool to do something like this and have it like... So if they want to, they can go from one side to the other. But I don't know exactly how they climb on it. So will they just, you know, go up that one, go across the log, or w might they go up a different log? I don't know. Should we just put it like this so they can escape? <laughs> hmm, I wonder how that one would work. Probably not well. Um, was I going to move trees? I forget. I had a plan. Probably wasn't a great plan, but it was still a plan. Or I think I was going to put it like this. Okay, yeah, that sounds like something I might do. Okay, we're going to move this whole wall. Edit barrier. We're going to grab up here. All the way around here. And then we're just going to move it. I wish there was a way I can lock it, but I can't. See, now it's all different. It's not... It's on a slight bend. Okay, well, fine. Just cancel everything I did. I just wanted to try again, but no, you just like, you know what, fine. You don't get to move any wall. Yeah, I wish there was a lock to keep it going the way. Angle snap. There might be, but I don't see it. I'm using angle snap. I held control and I held shift and it just didn't work the way I wanted it to. So, that has to be good enough. Okay. Hopefully the ground isn't that bad and whatever we just added to the exhibit they're fine with. I do see light creeping underneath it. Okay, it's not floating. <laughs> Just making sure. Let's go with this thing, and let's put it like so. I still feel like they'll be able to clean, cleanly jump out of the exhibit if I place this here. Eh, maybe not. Okay, we can put another tree over in this corner now that we have room. We can move this to... They still need to get over here, so maybe we have to move this tree. And then we can move this tree so it's not... Or, you know what? We don't have to move it too much. Just out a little bit. I don't mind it being kind of in the rock. Because if this was the wild, you know, that could happen. It could grow up through the rocks. They could still get over here and climb and jump over here, maybe. Probably not. I don't know. Sweet! We added something for them to do. And back here is hidden away from the prying eyes of the guests so they can't be annoyed. I still want to add more plants to this place. Why is their welfare down so much? Why is it down so much? Huh. There is a way we can do a thing. I forget what exactly we can do to get the plants they want. Because with the nature one, you can't, you don't have the species tab. But there was a way, and I forget what that way is. Let's go with tropical. Because that's what they want, right? Tropical, yes. This is what I want as well. I want to add tropical plants. Because now we're just guessing. We can't actually see what they like. But like I said, I think there's a way to do it, and I don't know what that way is. Swiss cheese plant. That can't be the actual name of it. Is it? There's no way. Oh, that's kind of annoying. I want to put it by the roots of the thing, but... 
I guess because this is counts as part of the tree because of the way the roots are, I can't. Unless I advance move it. Good. Right? You like you like you, you don't like those lobster you don't that looks like something you would love. Oh cool, it's just easily able to change it like that. Okay, South America. So apparently they don't like things from South America. Africa and Asia. So we switch by continent now. Uh uh, what was that? Africa and Asia. It was both of them. Okay. I don't know if uh, it's a specific one of those they like, or they're fine with both. But I guess we're going to find out. I could just look at the freaking book and see, but, you know, it's... Where's the fun in that? What's this? They love that, too. Again, I feel like there should be way more clutter on the ground. It just feels so empty. For a, a tropical rainforest exhibit, I guess what I really want is I just want a section of tropical rainforest in this zoo, which I don't think is a thing. <laughs> I think it's something that I'm imagining in my brain. Put that there. Let's get another one over here. Rotate a little bit. So it's not the same exact orientation as that other thing. Grab one of those. It's so tiny. Which works, but like I feel like we need more. They also like stuff from temperate and grasslands, so... We might be able to get away with something here. Grassland. What do we got? Some nettles. It's not good enough. not what I want. Ah! And I said, I want a lot. Like, a lot of ground cover. Like, I'll, I can't stress out how much ground cover. I want a lot of it. Like, a crazy amount. Wow. They don't mind the nettles. Look at that. See how small they are? It's not good enough. Okay, what's the other thing they like? Grassland. Oh, we already had grassland. Temperate. What? Is grassland and temperate the same thing? No, there's just a little bit more. Yeah, they don't have what I want. What I want is a lot more plants. And, uh... They don't exist. Which makes me sad. Aloe vera. Plant isn't from the same environment as the animal. But apparently they're fine with that. It's not, like, big, red, and scary, like, if you put the wrong thing in. <laughs> That's a big plant. Can I move that over there? Or is this the one they hated? No, they're fine with that. Okay. I guess we can have a few more of them in different spots. I don't know. Like, I still feel like there should be more here. But, you work with what you got. They're happy with their exhibit. See? Adequate plant and tree coverage. I just feel like there should be way more. Hold on. Can we turn off... No, not position snap. Align to surface. There we go. So now I can do things like... Like this. And we don't have to worry about using advanced move, which means I can do this a lot faster. Which is exactly what I want, and I'm starting to get the, uh, like, this is what I was thinking of. Just a lot of plants. And since this is the biggest one, this is the one we will be using over and over and over and over and over and over, and over again. See where else can I put some over here? Sure, why not? Put a bunch over here. Pop! 
Perfect. We get some smaller ones as well. No, I'm clicking near. Yeah. It's too close to the tree. It's essentially in the tree. Now we got the plant. Copy. Cool. Copy. Rotate it a bit. Copy. I think I'm just gonna get rid of those nettles. They're kind of just. Kind of just dumb and in the way. Right, it's in the tree. I can't get rid of it. Oh, keep the game paused. Please. I'm not prepared. Put some of these over here. It's starting to look better, but like I said, I still want more. But I don't think there's anything else we can do here. Okay, good. Just completely move my animals. Unbox them all. All right. Do they need more enrichment? Apparently they need toy enrichment because the things I added aren't good enough. Can they reach that one? I put it there so they'd knock it out of the zoo, which would be hilarious. I got some VIPs, apparently. Yeah, I don't know any of you. Don't know you. Hello, welcome. Don't know you. Hello, welcome. No idea who you are. Welcome. Nope, don't know you. Welcome. Domo? I heard he was big in Japan. But I also don't know him. Okay. What are these? Ostrich is hungry. How is this a thing? Do we need more food places? Moto Dragon is low welfare. I think we need more of these things. I'm just gonna copy and paste this. We may need another zookeeper to get on this exhibit. Is that elephant alive? Okay. Yeah, no, he's alive. He's choosing a very strange spot to sleep. His guests are probably very confused. I think we should have a donation box on the other side as well. Money, money, money. It costs us 50 and there's zero upkeep, so. Yeah, those shelters aren't full, so. It's fine. What is this? Stop having to queue to use facility. Okay, so it's definitely the workshop. We only have one workshop. That's been our problem this whole time. Here, I thought we had two workshops for the longest time. There we go. So now they can stop queuing, which explains why it's taking so long to get bigger staff rooms. Because it wasn't staff rooms at all. It was actually just the workshops for mechanics. Yeah. Good. Alpha status. Overcrowded. What is it? The lizards? It is the lizards. I mean, they're fine, right? It's not like there's 500 adults in here. <laughs> Yikes! Alright, let's worry about this now. Let's see. That would fall under. Animal exhibit zoo. Got it. Okay. <laughs> Took a while. Animals. I love how we were here at first and then like, I clicked off to something else. Komodo dragon. That's a lot of Komodo dragons. Two of them are in the Trade Center because they are the original ones. The fact that Luigi still has that much appeal kind of hurts, but okay. All right, you. What about you? Those are some pretty good stats. What about Inten? Those are also really good stats. I'm fine with these two just sticking here. They're both three years old. We could get rid of these other ones, unless there's one that's better, but their appeals are not nearly as good, which... Yeah, you suck. You're five years old. How come you still look like a baby, though? Are you a baby? Crap, they are babies. That would explain it. Why do we have so many that are the same name as well? I know we've seen two Intens, and now we've seen two, uh... Kadiks? Is that how you say that? Probably not. 
But I honestly just think we're going to keep these two and get rid of the rest of them. Except for Squirtle and Luigi. They were our first ones. They get to stay. Ooh, you. You are 12 years old. Female. Intent has better stats, though, right? Yeah. Eh. A little bit, I think. Dumondi. Yeah, I think we're just going to get rid of the rest of these. Some of them have crappy fertility stats. Yeah, what on earth? Get out of my zoo. You're gone, you're gone, you're gone, you're gone, you're gone. We'll keep it Squirtle, we'll keep it Luigi. We gotta wait for these other ones to grow up. I'm just gonna put them on contraceptives now. And release to the wild. That should be a decent amount of points, right? That's it. Oh, did I select the wrong one? My bad. I thought I'd get way more for that. They're freaking endangered, aren't they? Aren't they? Was I wrong in assuming that? Species. Let's see. Sort by not welfare locate. No, no, appeal. I just want to look at these other ones real quick. Yeah, you suck. You're staying on birth control. You suck. Yeah, you guys are awful. Ugh, get out of my zoo. All right, cool. These animals are all hungry. Hello, zookeepers. Don't we have two of them on this exhibit? We need one more. Also, why are you in a box? Also, is this elephant dead? It's been laying here for so long. Thank you for finally bringing food. Is, are you starving to death? Oh, no, he's up. Good morning. I think we just need more zookeepers on this exhibit. Good news is our turtles are about to have more offspring, and, uh... <laughs> we haven't had a single tortoise grow up yet. The original two are still the ones. Oh my, these are all their babies! And they're all just wheezing. They hit adulthood. At what age? I don't actually know, but 14... How long have we had the zoo? 26 years? Tortoises are one of the first things we got? That's so funny. They age so slowly. We still don't have another adult tortoise. That is, that's amazing. Anyway. Um... Why is my camera moving so slow? There we go. We need, um, to... Zookeepers. More zookeepers in here, because this is not... This is not good. So let's do it. Plus, we have the money for it, because we're rich. Look at that. Cash flow. Income. It's a lot of money. We have a lot of outgoing expenses, but... We are making a lot of money. So let's hire another dude. Zoo. Staff. Keeper. I think we already have two here, but... Clearly it ain't enough. No work zone. We want... Crazy big. Crazy big, crazy big, crazy big. Yes, we already do have two there. Yeah, see, look. They all just eat the food so quickly. Between gathering all the poops and feeding them, we just need more. And we also need to look at the actual... Yeah, see? We have way too many of some animals again, and it's amazing how frequently this happens. I don't know which ones, but... Clearly... What happened on the ground here? I wonder if putting this thing in ruined it. Yeah, we need to do something about it. Look, empty again. Is this the largest one? Food truck. It is the large one. 
Can we get a larger one? Like one suitable for an elephant? Drafts are inbreeding. That's fine. Good for them. Don't care. Food. Food tray, large. No, we don't want tiger one. Yeah, that's the largest one. It just doesn't feel that large. Yeah. It really doesn't, but it is. Ah. <laughs> it's the best noise that any animal in the zoo makes. Okay, buffalo. Are Do we not have a male water buffalo? What happened to our male water buffalo? Did he die? Did he get sent to the trade center? What the hell happened to our male water buffalo? He just doesn't exist. Did we never? Did we never get one? No, we definitely had one. I guess we need a water buffalo. First, let's pause and look at this. Let's look at the antelopes. I said pause. Antelopes are always a problem. Sable antelope. All right, we got two of them are pregnant. Hooray. I feel like every second that we take care of this, this happens. Are you better than the other one? You're three years old. No, your stats are awful. Okay, so you... Goodbye. Later. All right, who else? There's a lot of females here. I might just get one female, honestly. Because having four, I think, is just... it. These numbers go insane. So maybe the, the top two. You have a lot of appeal. Not terrible stats. You. Your fertility's awful, but honestly, I don't think that's going to be a problem. What about Chippo? That's an even better antelope. Okay, you're gone. What about you? That's a pretty good antelope. Are you better than Chippo? 66, 83, 66, 100. 66, 66, 183. I would rather have the... 100 in immunity and not for fertility and longevity. So, Chippo is gone. We're keeping you. We're keeping you because you're the only male. We can't get rid of you, right? 66, 66, 83, 66. Yeah, we birth controlling you. Contraceptives. You. Suck. You're gone. You are with child. We can't get rid of you. Jaha. You are gone. You. Oh, wait. No, I clicked the wrong one. Yep. Fertility, toilet, gene. Okay, you're gone. And we can't get rid of Lulu either. All right. Good. We're releasing all those to the wild. I am a great zookeeper. Doo -doo. All right. Huzzah. Now what? We need another buffalo. Because apparently, the male buffalo vanished. And I don't know where it went. Or we never had one. So. African buffalo. Filter. Yeah, there's a male right there. 4,000? I think we now know why we never had one. Because there's only one male. And this person wants a stupid amount of money for it. What if we max everything out? Fresh list. Wow. Who knew? Who knew that buffalo males were so hard to come by? Is that a thing? Or... I feel as though they're not that rare. I just want to see the Zoopedia, but apparently... It doesn't want me to click the things anyway. Okay, that's fine. Didn't want to click them. The fact that we don't have a mail, though, is just bizarre. I can't see me doing that. 
I can't see me adding them to the zoo without a male. Is there a way I can see this? Hold on, I think there is. Near threatened. The largest member of the cow family. Found in the African wild. They're identified by the long distinctive horns, which are born horns. No species not in danger. African wild is still by human activity. Now it says nothing about males being rare. Yeah, look at I don't understand. I really don't get it. He disappeared. He must have disappeared. He must have vanished. Or didn't exist, but I'm pretty sure he existed, so he must have disappeared. Animal trading. Isn't there a history? <gasps> there is. Huh? It only has recent transactions. So we can't actually see. Okay, that's great. Love it. All right, and with that, I think we're gonna end this one here. I may have to worry about ostriches soon. All right, can't wait for that. But the Bengal tigers, I think, are doing well. None of them are breaking out, and they are, uh... Look at that, they're running around their exhibit. I don't know what I'm gonna make the screenshot for this video. So we just worked on this exhibit more. So that's great, I now need to take a picture of an animal. What should I be? What should it be? Um, I have no idea. But I'm going to end this one here. <laughs> Next episode, I don't know what we're going to be doing, but it should be great. Thank you all for watching. Leave a like and share the video if you enjoyed that. Help it a lot. Subscribe if you want to see more, and I'll see you next time.